Max, what are the biggest innovations, three big ones that you see coming this decade and what impact do you expect them to have on development in Africa and benefits to the people of Africa? I would say three of the biggest things that I see coming. Uh, one is commercial space operations and space opportunities. Um, we are just seeing a dramatic increase in the number of startups um, with innovative ideas from all over the world who now, because of things like AWS Cloud Services, AWS Ground Station, are able to access um, opportunities in space. So I think that's a big one. I think the next one is health. Um, Health has been a, um, a, a challenging thing to work with in so many ways in the past, and yet now with the uh, many of the advancements born out of the fire of the COVID-19 pandemic, we're able to reach populations with telehealth consultation at far greater scale. Um, in India, we developed a system called eSanjeevni, and they were able to initially handle thousands Six, six, seven thousand uh, telehealth consultations a day. They're now well up into the tens of thousands, in fact, hundreds of thousands of telehealth consultations a day. Imagine populations around the world that have difficult access to health and the, and the capabilities now that you've got leveraging Amazon Cloud to improve population health. And I think a third one that's very important, I mean, it's, it's critical to all of our long-term survival is the focus on sustainability. Uh, and so whether you take a look at what AWS and Amazon are doing in the area of renewable energies, all our AWS cloud computing centers will be powered by renewable energy by 2025. If you look at what's being done uh, to address uh, car net carbon neutrality, um, we've set goals for ourselves and then 300 other organizations, including governments, to be net carbon neutral by 2040, a full 10 years ahead of the Paris Accord. Um, and then of course, you've water is a scarce resource and a scarce commodity in many places around the world. And so we're taking action now on how do we be uh, water positive. AWS has uh, declared we'll be water positive by 2023. Uh, and I think the final thing I would say is back to space. The opportunities to improve life on Earth from space using Earth observation is just um, unlimited. Um, whether it is improving farming, whether it is faster action for natural disasters and uh, disaster relief, whether it is maritime operations and making ports and supply chains more effective, there's just tremendous applications from space that are going to help us in terms of life right here on Earth. Thank you, Max.